What is the value of the expression 9 plus 3 divided by 3 inside the parentheses and all of them to the power of 2 then divided by 4 multiplied by 2? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? This expression has tricked almost 90% of people. Let's go step by step and solve it together. And the first step to solve this question, many people go straight to the parentheses and start with the expression 9 plus 3. So, instead of this expression, they write 12 divided by 3 inside the parentheses, all the squared divided by 4 then multiplied by 2. And the next step, they go for the division between 12 and 3. And instead of this expression, they write 4 squared divided by 4 multiplied by 2. Then, they say it's time for the exponent. And instead of this expression, they write 16 divided by 4 then multiplied by 2. And the final step, they go for the division between 16 and 4 and simplify this expression to 4 multiplied by 2, which finally gives them the answer 8. Then, without any hesitation, they quickly say that the correct answer to this question is option B. However, this answer is absolutely wrong. Also, some other people to solve this question first go for the parentheses and start with the division between the threes. So, instead of this expression, they write 9 plus 1 inside the parentheses all the squared divided by 4 multiplied by 2. And the next step, they go for the addition between 9 and 1 and simplify this expression to 10 squared divided by 4 multiplied by 2. Then, they simplify 10 squared and write this expression as 100 divided by 4 multiplied by 2. In the final step, they go for the multiplication between 4 and 2 because they believe multiplication has priority over division. So, instead of this expression, they write 100 divided by 8, which finally gives them the answer 12.5. And immediately, they conclude that option C is the correct answer to this question. But, I have to say, we have been tricked again and it's not the correct answer to this question. Now let's go step by step together and solve this question correctly. As you can see on the screen, in this expression, first we have a parenthesis, then exponent, followed by a division sign, and finally a multiplication. To solve this question, we need to go step by step exactly according to the PEMDAS rule. It means that we must perform all the operations in order from top to bottom following the PEMDAS rule. So, first we start with the expression inside the parentheses, because parentheses have the highest priority than the other operations. Alright, as you can see, inside the parentheses, we have an addition sign followed by a division sign. We must start with the division, because division has a higher priority than addition. So, instead of this expression, we can write 9 plus 1 inside the parentheses all the squared divided by 4 multiplied by 2. In the next step, we need to simplify the expression inside the parentheses even more. So, this expression simplifies to 10 squared divided by 4 multiplied by 2. Now, it's time for the exponent. So, instead of this expression, we write 100 divided by 4 multiplied by 2. In the final step, we handle the division and multiplication. However, it's very important to note that according to the PEMDAS rule, Multiplication and division have exactly the same level of priority. The best approach in this situation is to start from the left and move toward the right, performing these two operations in order. So, we start with the division between 100 and 4, and this expression simplifies to 25 multiplied by 2, which finally gives us the answer 50. Therefore, option D is the correct answer to this question.